We are now removing our Bradbury murals that have been in this particular building for 40 years and the whole collection is going to Colorado Springs, El Paso County to be hung over there and enjoyed over there. We were trying to find a home that would take all nine pieces and we have. They didn't have room for them and so they were trying to to give them away to entities all over the country and we got an email from them and said yes we would take them. We then set about trying to figure out how to move them here and we were we sent out bids to art movers and, and curators to help us in that whole process. This is something that Obviously the county doesn't do every day and we're not very good at it or we don't think we are. So uh, we contracted with uh, a company here in Colorado Springs to move those murals for us. What we're doing right now is checking the condition before they're moved. They'll be moved and once they're moved again and reinstalled, I will check them again to make sure nothing has happened to them. What I've just been doing with these murals is I put on my head loops and I look very closely for any damages that might be on the painting right now. And if I see anything that looks fresh or new, I note that. I make a report on everyone. I also photograph everyone and if there's damage, I photograph that. Sometimes we see something interesting like on this one where we can see the graphite of her underdrawing. And so we note that so that somebody doesn't think somebody's been marking on it. So I look at that, if it's necessary, like there may be a small crack, I might put some consolidant in to make sure it doesn't move while it's being moved. And then once it gets there, I check everything again the same way, and then it can be reinstalled. When the project first came up and I started looking at this, I found it extremely interesting and beneficial for the Colorado Springs community. Leona Bradbury was a significant artist both in Colorado and also in New York. So what we have here are works by a Colorado artist who was very influential in the area in the 30s and 40s. These works I find to be intriguing, beautiful, delightful, and they're fun. They're rich with memories that most of us have. They have historical significance in the sense that they were done in a crucial period in American history, a major turning point both for this country and for the arts in this country. And I think for we in El Paso County to have something like this, it's just, it's a major plus for us, both historically and culturally and artistically. We are happy that they've gotten a home where they're all going to be enjoyed by other people and where the whole series uh, is going to be displayed, which was our big concern. We didn't want to break them up. We wanted to make sure that the whole series went and uh, we'll miss them. They're a beautiful um, piece of artwork and we've enjoyed them all this time.